everyone, headed to a call in Ahwatukee. A gentleman just called, he has two rattlesnakes in his backyard, uh, and I'm headed that way now. I don't know what kind or anything like that, so I'm really excited, so let's go see. How are you? Good, how are you? Good, so he's got two rattlesnakes? I can't tell, I know for sure one's a rattlesnake, but the other one you couldn't really tell. Oh, really, okay. Does that happen to you a lot? We get calls from people yeah. like that sometimes, yeah. Um, do you want to see pictures of them? Sure, like? yeah. <gasps> it's a speckled rattlesnake. And then That's what I was hoping. This one was like under. That looks like a gopher snake. That's yeah, cool. Woo! Speckled rattlesnake. Very cool. Did he, rat he rattled at you? No. No, just you just saw it. I saw him when I was walking on it. Luckily. Yeah. Yeah, so I was gonna, funny, saw the rattlesnake and I was like, well, maybe I can, you know, get him with, ah, just poke him with a stick and he take get off out go. the bench. Yeah. And then when I did that is when I saw this other snake. Oh, <laughs> like, oh my gosh, they're all over. So he's right there. Okay, that's the gopher. Okay, let's get the rattlesnake. Rattle, are you still curled up? Right I'm there? still curled up. Dang, look at him. So cool, he's so pretty. Good eye on seeing that other one too. Yeah. <laughs> I'll bring him over there. You guys can take a look at him. So gorgeous. All right. Let's see. What's this one? It's a gopher snake, so they're harmless. Good to have around, to be honest. So if you want to keep him, he's not going to hurt you. You want me yeah. to take him? Uh, but not poisonous. No, harmless. Okay, that's okay. You keep him, yeah. He'll just eat your rodents. <laughs> See him? Nice. Very nice. You want to keep him? Yeah. Okay. Oh, nice. there's a scorpion back there, too. Yeah, I love him. Is... <laughs> oh, any sharks or anything? Uh, I don't know. Maybe in the pool? <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys want to see this one? Yeah. All right. So gorgeous. Gorgeous. So what? Speck, it's called a speckled rattlesnake. Yeah. What will you do with this? I'll take him back into South Mountain here and Mountain. find him a nice spot. So, no, 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 no. <laughs> a little farther. <laughs> a little farther. Cool little guy. Yeah. <laughs> Got this speck here. He's trying to climb out. I want to show you how gorgeous he is. Maybe he'll come on out when we're in zone. So I'm slither out here. Oh, hey there, bud. Yep, you cool. Wow, look at that snake. <gasps> look at that snake. Oh my goodness. See a speck. Hey everybody, it is 10.30 p.m. on Saturday and I am headed out to Anthem right now. It is about an hour and a half drive and there's a rattlesnake on a back porch and it is a race against time to go get it. You know, sometimes this is the way this thing goes, you know, that we're 24 hour service and that often means that uh, there's a potential for running across town when you're tired. So let's see what we got. Hello. Hi. You're gonna have to make sure it is where I think it is. Okay, hey, no, that's fine. Okay, so where was he seen last? He, he... was seen last, see where that white dog food container is? Uh huh. I went inside to make the call and when I came back. Okay. I didn't see him, but. And it was a rattlesnake? Definitely a rattlesnake. Okay. Not behind it. Nobody there. Um, well, let's. Take a tour. I will take a tour. You found it. Oh, you found it? Right here. Oh, <laughs> I walked the wrong direction. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah. I know. 
You want to be slippery, don't you? All right. You want to see it up close? Yeah. Okay. It can't get out or anything. It's it's too too small. So I'm glad you saw it. It, it, it went the opposite way that I was walking. We were literally just sitting right here, and then I, but can, are, can we still look through the yard though? Sure. Like if it's this small, there's probably others, yeah. right? Not necessarily for that age. So this snake, it didn't really smell at me, and like at all. I was pretty close. They to rely pretty pretty heavily on uh, camouflage until they know they've been caught. A snake that looks like it's sleeping could very well also be going, don't see me, please don't see me. You know what I mean? Yeah. And, and that's what it was doing right there when you're sitting there is it's sitting there being like, I know she doesn't see me, so I'm not going to move. Uh, then it started rattling and, and having a problem once he's like, oh man, they caught me. <laughs> yeah, not always, not always. In fact, uh, I would say more often than not, they don't and they just wait for you to walk by because they are good at camouflage. I don't see anybody else though. Okay, well, out into the deep dark desert that I am by no means familiar with. I mentioned before that this is creepy. I still stand by that when it is 12.30 in the morning in the desert on the other side of town. You got kind of no reading on not only the animals, but kind of like what's going on with people out here. All right, kind of low on battery, so I'm gonna do this quick. Got a little baby rattlesnake, and it's going in those bushes. Whoa, not towards me. Here, let's go. There we go, that way. <laughs> All right, battery's about dying and I'm in the dark. So, see you later, buddy. All right, well, that was easy enough. Young rattlesnake in a backyard. It looks like those people are actually getting snake fencing pretty soon, which is necessary, I guess. I am about to fill up. Don't fill up in the uh, New River. <laughs> Yikes. Pipe breaking out at the shell in New River. <laughs> but I am loaded up on copious amounts of caffeine and I am going to find the loudest, most obnoxious rock music that I can find to keep me up and going strong on the way home. Thank you for watching.